everyone and welcome to today's I guess it's kind of like vlogmas but it's not really vlogmas but anyway it's day eight today and today I'm going to be making my little dog a cookie did you do this cookie and this video is going to be interspersed with some great images if I do say so myself and wonderful videos of my little dog running around being her usual doggy self so if you like dogs keep watching cookie is a cocker spaniel and we shall get on with the making of little cookie so I know I'm really biased but cookie is one of the cutest dogs that has ever existed she has the most gorgeous golden fur well she's a golden cocker so Obviously she's got golden fur. And then I saw this throw when we went to Tesco last. Um, I think they're Dachshunds, but they actually look so much like Cookie. I had to get them. So that is keeping me warm at the moment. I feel like if anyone's going to be able to look after her, it will be Camilla. So let's go and make her in Camilla's world. And then hopefully Cookie could be adopted by Camilla. I don't know. So this, this guy can go. I don't know who this guy is. As I said before, Cookie is a Cocker Spaniel, so I'm going to type Spaniel in because I think there's quite a few uh, different ones. Yeah, there's Cocker Spaniel and English Cocker Spaniel. Um, that's not the option I want to be on right now. Here we go. So this is Cocker Spaniel. Oh, it's so cute. And this is English Cocker Spaniel. So I think the English one is actually a lot closer. When I looked at it with Sam, my sister, I thought maybe it wasn't. But I think the the main thing that we're going to have to focus on with creating this, well, cookie, is she has very, um, very strange colour patterns that, don't get me wrong, they're absolutely gorgeous, but they are, they're quite odd, they're quite different. So we'll be doing a lot of painting. But I think, uh, firstly, <laughs> how close together or far away are Cookie's eyes? Her eyes are massive. They're not that big, but they are massive. Um, maybe, maybe something like that. I think that's the right shape. I think I'm just going to make him a little bit smaller, but that's definitely the right shape. And her eyes are like that most of the time. Is this a her, firstly? It is a her. Okay, good. That would be a travesty if I made a boy. The thing is, okay, so Cookie's got a very flat head, but she has like these butler kind of flaps. <laughs> um, she, oh, she's such a cute little girl. Um, there's another picture of her. Like she has kind of like the traditional butler hairstyle. So I don't think we're gonna be able to, to actually do that, which is, which is really sad. I'm going to try and move her ears in a little bit more because um, they're, they're quite... Okay, they're low down on her head. Her ears are really long as well, that's probably right. Um, her eyes are really dark in colour. That's the darkest we can go, which is a shame. And her nose is really weird, so it's very big. I think this is the best option. Um, and then her nose is a little bit pink on the end a bit like that but it's not that pink i only noticed it for the first time a couple of days ago so i think i'm gonna stick with like maybe a dark brown just to balance that out a bit and she's got like such a natural smile as well i wonder if i can detail edit mode go gonna give her a little bit of a salt oh, but she's so cute um and see if i can make her eyes a bit more cookie shaped she, this dog looks like Cookie already, I have to say. She's got a really round nose, which is nice. I think that's about right. I can't detail edit mode her ears, which is sad. I'm just, I'm just going to do that for now. She looks really weird on this because she doesn't have her, her butler fluffs. <laughs> which sounds really weird, but it's true. Okay, I need to find a picture of her. Okay, perfect. So, actually, that is pretty accurate. That is pretty accurate. Uh, can I change anything on here? Okay, I can make her bridge go up, but her bridge is actually quite inwards. I don't know how I would... Because she's got quite... Like, this bit of her head's quite a gradient. And I don't think I can quite do that. Right, Cookie 
is a little bit tubby. Like, she's not overweight, but she has so much fluff. Well, she's a little bit tubby. But her legs are really skinny. I don't, has anyone else come across that before? Okay, so I can do this one. Or this one. Because she is always wagging her tail, but I think we'll go for that one. We can change her fur. No, that's wrong. That's very good. I think that's the one it was already on. Also, her head's really big. How... Yeah, see, Cookie's head's just not that big. Why doesn't she look like Cookie? What's... what's missing? Have I... I think... okay, I think what I've done is I have changed the fur from what it originally was. Okay, so that's what it was. Okay. So, sadly, she's like somewhere in between both of those. I mean, she does look like Cookie. But I want to find out how to to paint her coat different colours. Cookie, bless her little soul, is a golden cocker. What have I done? What's this? No thanks. Her face colour is very light. So I'm just going to paint some lightness onto her there. I kind of want to see if I can mimic her butler hair. So I'm just going to try and build that up a little bit. So her snout, I suppose is what you call it. It's actually really dark compared to the rest of her. Why can I not paint that bit? Let's just make this darker. And then her cheeks are so light compared to it. And then, okay. Her tummy is also really white. Her like fluffy, sorry, not her tummy, her chest. Uh, and then like the top is like almost white, but it's not white. I think I've accidentally made her face too blonde though. So let's go and put some more darkness on her head. Is there a way she could sit that would make this easier? I feel like I'm contouring her. What? Uh, and then her ears start off really blonde at the top. And then as they go down, they just get darker. And then the tips are quite dark. As in dark in comparison to the rest of her. Uh, I think that's quite good. Maybe like that? Her paws are also very blonde. Or a little paws. If you guys like this video and you like seeing Cookie, um, stay tuned and if you haven't already subscribed because not only will I be bringing her back onto this channel, but I actually have a video coming up which is unboxing dog toys with Cookie. And don't get me wrong, she loves doing those videos. If I remember, I'll put it in the little um, eye button. Because we've done one before and she really enjoyed it. Oh. Didn't mean to give her a... <laughs> a... <laughs> a bum. Oh, cute. Okay, that's better. I can't remember if she's got any colour down her back, so I'm just going to... Not that much. I'm just going to kind of do highlights she's so gorgeous i know i'm biased but she is i think we're getting there like she's a very typical cocker spaniel but very atypical in color i really want to put the white things in but can i just do that no i shouldn't do that okay so one thing she does have which i love to pieces she's got little eyebrows they're really subtle and you can't see them very much but when you know they're there, you can see them and it's so cute. Okay, so while we're here as well, I'm just going to call her Cookie because that's her name. Um, and I'm going to give her the last name Stark because I really think she should go and live with Camilla. Let me know if you like that idea in the comments down below. And now basically, I want to get her a collar that matches the one she's got. And she's got like a lovely pink coloured collar. But I don't think we're going to find one that close. Oh, she's so cute. I wish I could give her like the tufts of hair that she has. Like, look at her little hair. Okay, I'm gonna get Simon over to have a look if he's interested. Actually, before I do, I've just remembered. She's got like a little bit of a white patch under her nose. Her lip is a lot closer to her nose than this is letting me do. So I might have to fake it a little bit. I'm just going to make it darker. I'm not going to get it as 
dark as it actually is because I don't have the patience for that. Do you want to come and see Cookie? Yeah, she looks really good from all angles, but apart from the front. I can't do anything. Do you know what it is? It's her little tuft. Well, not just that. I think, I, I don't know, her nose looks too big to me. Her nose is huge. Oh god, yeah, you're right, it is quite. It's her bigger nose... at the top and yeah. it goes in. Which I did try to do. So yeah, that is better. Yeah, it is. I thought they were more brown than that. I can't, that's the darkest brown. That's the darkest oh. colour. Like, they can be that colour, but mm. they're not. They're dark. Dogs. You need CC eyes for dogs. Guys, if you're listening and you're a good CCer, then please hook us up because need those CC eyes for the doges. It's, you, I think that's the closest we're going to get. I'm really proud of Yeah, you've done how really well. good she looks. It's close. I just wish we could go further. Oh, look, we can make her muscular. She's not, but we can. I wish you could give her eyelashes. Yeah, that'd Honestly, be lovely. It because... is just the fluff. We just need to be able to add fluff. I kind of gave her the eyebrows and the butler thing. Yeah. It's just, yeah, there's just no fluff options. Well done. It's great. Thank you. Uh, so her traits at the moment, she's a hunter. She's hairy. I'm sorry, but she is so hairy. Is there a lazy option? Couch potato. So she's a hunter, she's hairy, and she's a couch potato. Is that the most cookie thing you've ever heard in your life? Let's see if we can get a bark that's quite similar. Cookie's got a relatively low bark. That's that's quite similar. Um, so this is Cookie as a puppy. Okay, she looked nothing like that as a puppy, but she looks so good as an adult. So we'll give her that. Oh, and then as an elder. Oh my god, Simon, come and see what Cookie's gonna look like as an elder. Oh, why she looks so sad? She's old. Oh. oh. And then that's her as an adult, and yeah. then this is her as a puppy. Which looks nothing like she looked like no. as a puppy. She wants little belly rubs. <laughs> I know, a little, little bit. That looks like Cookie. It does, but her belly should be bare. Oh yeah, she's got a really white belly, hasn't she? Well, pink. Do you say that's more? Yeah, I wouldn't say it comes that high up. Thank you for reminding me about her white tummy. Okay guys, so here we go. This is Cookie. Look out for her coming in an episode of the Homeless Challenge. And I still need a name for that. So if you guys can think of a name, please let me know down in the comments below. But look out for her in a future episode of the Homeless Challenge. Hopefully she'll get on with our little yogi. And um, hopefully she'll really enjoy being Camilla's doge as well. So that's all for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed and I will see you next time. Goodbye.